During an extreme storm, including hail and a strong tornado, which hit southern Moravia on Thursday evening, June 24, 2021, the V497 Sokolnice Stupova line, with a voltage level of 400 kilovolts, was damaged. The rampaging tornado, not normally seen in the Czech Republic, and with wind speeds reaching up to 324 kilometers per hour, was referred to by meteorologists as a category F4. The tornado caused considerable surface damage in a swath 26 kilometers long and up to 700 meters wide. And in this area, near Breslov, seven masts fell and the eighth supporting mast of the line was damaged. The owner and operator management decided to put the damaged section back into operation quickly. It was decided to use an alternative transmission route called NPT, which will be operated with reduced transmission capacity, is used after natural disasters or in the reconstruction of overhead power lines. The replacement transmission route was designed according to the current PNE 333-300 Edition 2 standard and is located along the current V497 line in the damaged area. The height difference between the replacement transmission system and the standard line masts is approximately half, which are built three times denser to maintain a safe distance of conductors above the ground. It is a mobile line. Masts do not have solid concrete foundations. Their construction stands on wooden sleepers. Depending on their size and for stability reasons, they are anchored with at least eight rope ground anchors. During the implementation and construction of the alternative transmission route in the section near Bretzlov on Saturday, July 17, 2021, the dragging of wires over the D2 motorway took place. Pulling wires over a highway is always very demanding to ensure safety. Therefore, at the 51st kilometer of the motorway, traffic was diverted into one lane in both directions on a roughly 200 meter stretch from morning until afternoon. Within the planned three week schedule, Omexam GA Energo employees built the longest alternative transmission route in the Czech Republic. The route leads through the aforementioned D2 motorway and measures 3,150 meters with a total number of 33 masts. Thus, electricity transmission was restored in the damaged line until its final repair can be made. We are Omexam GA Energo. We are connecting the world with energy.